having spent uh, many years as a primary care physician treating hypertension thousands of times, it is absolutely the case that you know there's a few common medications that you, you pick and you try to be uh, reasonable, responsible, look out for side effects, but there hasn't really been very strong guidance about picking between the bunch. And one of the reasons why I like to stay engaged with Odyssey is the idea that we want to work on actionable problems. So you need to look at diseases that affect a large number of individuals across the whole world. And I think hypertension really fits that, really fits that bill. Hypertension is an extremely prevalent disease and there's a lot of treatments out there. And yet right now the evidence for which treatment is the right choice for a given patient isn't currently available. If you look at the U.S. guideline for hypertension, um, it makes many recommendations, but it's based on just a few randomized trials that have been done. So what we're trying to do is fill in the gap to allow us to produce evidence that can tell us to build a better guideline, a more specific guideline make specific recommendations of which drug is really better and for which patients. And so within the legend experiment, we were able to conduct the world's largest study of hypertension to examine all of the comparative safety and effectiveness questions about alternative therapies. If you have the right large enough numbers, you have a rigorous approach, you can actually look across millions of patients at thousands of questions and actually ask this and answer this one real question, which is, what should I start my patient on? There are drugs called ACE inhibitors and there are other drugs called thiazide diuretics and they were considered equal and ACE inhibitors are used half the time in the world's population for new use in hypertension. And we're saying, you know, ACE inhibitors are good drugs but thiazides are better. We can save many heart attacks around the world if we just switch from the ACE inhibitors to the thiazide diuretics. So that's something, imagine that. Half the world's population would change what drug it's on based on the evidence that we're generating as part of legend. And it's a very big deal when when you have an a, a apple to orange direct comparison that everyone said, well, it's about the same, it's a toss up. And we say, no, actually apples are much safer. They work better. The outcomes are better. That's really big, big information. I am sure that any of my primary care colleagues would say in a heartbeat, yeah, I would change my practice based on that.